Encampments leading to serious crime. Owners of a business in the St. John's neighborhood of Portland are sharing their story after the city made a major effort to clear out a vehicle encampment nearby. It comes after they say people at that encampment caused thousands of dollars in damage to their business. Fox 12's Adrian Thomas has the story from St. John's tonight. Yeah, we're here at Kurtz RV Storage in North Portland, and for the last year, the family who runs this RV storage lot says dozens of people have been climbing over this cinder block fence right here in this area and breaking into the offices here on site and breaking into RVs and even a couple of tow trucks that are stored on this lot were stolen. This week, the city finally cleaned the encampment up, but for the family who runs Kurtz RV Storage, it's a year too late. The family's owned the business since 1970, and we're at a point where we just all want to close up and leave. Jeff White of Kurtz RV Storage says he and his family's business has been stretched thin dealing with vandalism and threats from people living in this encampment off North Columbia Boulevard. We told you about this same camp back in September, and the difference between then and now is dramatic. A city spokesperson says cleanup began this past Tuesday and 136 vehicles, including dozens of RVs, have been tagged and towed. The same spokesperson says those who had vehicles removed were offered connection to shelters. But White says he is still discouraged and fears the campers could return. It's definitely a step in the right direction, but is that where the step stops and then they come back Tuesday? And I like to look at things positively, but we've been just drugged through the mud. White shared surveillance video with us of people he says live in that camp breaking into the RV lot. Most recently, someone was caught on camera smashing the front door and stealing several computers. White is unsure what's next for Kurt's RV storage and says he's angry the city took this long to take care of the problem. And the move by the city this week to finally clean up this large encampment comes as city council also approved funding this week for Mayor Ted Wheeler's plan to ban camping in Portland and set up sanctioned campsites in St. John's. Adrian Thomas, Fox 12 Oregon.